So I'm with Kat Chatterton, and you're going to be playing... I'm playing Beauty. Beauty, in Beauty and the, the Beast, the Christmas panto. Um, would you be able to tell me just a little bit about about the panto? What what What's it about? What can people look forward to seeing? Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a classic love story, really. It's about learning to love under the surface of what someone looks like. And um, it's a, obviously it's panto, so it's great fun. There's some big laughs and some, you know, some nice emotional moments as well. It's a, you know, it's a, a show for all the family. It's great. Excellent. Um, would you be able to tell us a bit about yourself? Like, where you're from, where you, how you got into acting, yeah, if that's sure. how I like. So I'm from um, Ripon in North Yorkshire. Um, and then I moved to, to London to study musical theatre at Mount View Academy of Theatre Arts for one year. And I've just graduated um, this past Monday. So this is my first job outside of drama school. <laughs> so Excellent. I'm very how did that process come about then to, to get in that, that role, you know? You know, it was quite an easy process. I just applied and then Lou, the wonderful casting director, sent me an email asking me to come and audition and I went went to the studio where they were auditioning and I met some of the team um, and we did a few scenes, did a few songs and then a few weeks later I got an email with the contract info. So I was like, oh great, it's fun. Just made you Christmas, didn't yeah, it? Did you? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> So what does it mean to be playing beauty then? Oh, what, you know what does what? that mean? It actually means so much because like, as a kid, my Disney princess was always, was always Belle. So now I get to wear all the dresses. I get to, you know, be, be in that character all the time. And it just, it feels like a really nice, like circular moment for me that adds having beauty as, a, as my princess as, as a child. Excellent, <laughs> excellent. So what can people expect when they come to the show? What what will they uh, be looking forward to seeing the most? Do you think? You know what? I think you can expect a lot of sparkles, a lot of mess, a lot of laughs, and some emotional moments, um, and just a whole lot of fun. To be honest, I think that's what you can expect. Excellent. And um, what's it been like being in in Rotherham at the Civic as well? I can oh. imagine you're looking forward to, yeah, to actually, being here. It's a lovely theatre as well. It's so sort of connected and like you know everyone's around and it's all good vibes and things and rather it's very hilly so we all go on our you know lunch trips <laughs> up the hills <laughs> it's great i like it excellent and you know why why should people come and watch the panto what what, what would you say why should come, people come and watch the panto well, yes it's gonna be a, a Amazing. great day out <laughs> yes excellent um did you like uh Christmas pantos, is that kind of your tradition growing up as well? Definitely as a child, yeah. I would always go with my, my grandparents and uh, one year I got, actually two, two years, I got pulled up onto the stage, you know, doing the song sheet and I got to dance with the uh, with the dame, which I thought was <laughs> so much fun. Um, although I really wanted to, I think it was Jack and the Beanstalk and I really wanted to dance with Jack, but um, I danced with the, Jake, with the dame and I did that, you know, like his knee movement <laughs> up on stage and I got a free ice cream afterwards. So, you know, you know, I've always, you know, watched pantos and things. So it's really nice to do it as a professional actor now to be up there doing it for the kids. Excellent. I was going to say it's where a lot of dreams are made, especially for yeah, yeah. people that are acting and then the people in the audience mm. as well.